This is the soundtrack version for Mystery of Murasama's Castle along with the instruction manual for it. However, due to potential copyright problems, the music in the original video was replaced with something similar, and you can probably find the soundtrack released in Japan on eBay or other second-hand retailers, if you want it. For the original soundtrack, visit the link in the description. We edited the pages from Japanese to English to have things make sense. We provided insight on some areas to provide some clarity to some things that are unknown. The images you will see were upscaled, color corrected, adjusted and edited for presentation. We did our best to properly translate them. Absolutely no censorship was made. The edits were primarily due to source scan noise and color issues. Please consider supporting Miyaku Gaming if you like our English translations. We provide quality translations free of censorship and our focus is on accuracy. Finally, feel free to pause at any time if you need to read something, rewind or go to any point in this manual. Starting from the top, Mystery of Murasama's Mysterious Castle, Original Soundtrack, 1, Orchestra Version, 2, Mystery of Murasama's Castle Version. The second version is basically the music from the original Famicom Disk System game, not the orchestrated version. On the bottom left, it reads, Another Side, The Legend of Zelda, that will be covered in another video. Going up from that, it reads Original Soundtrack, Mystery of Murasama's Castle. To the left of Takamura, the guy with blue hair, is a box that reads, Orchestra Version. Originally, the orchestra is Kanjin Gakuden, the Japanese word for orchestra. This work comes from making use of a computer synthesizing system, sampling instrument system, better musical composition performance, the Famicom's original sound tone bass, it was orchestrated. It's funny because orchestra is both used in katakana, which is used for foreign words imported to Japanese, and kanji, which is a native Japanese word, I think they were trying to help readers understand it better. Now onto the bullet point just below. Sampling the bass sounds as nature sounds and instrument sounds, scale instructions being sent, consequently, the sound scale instructions from the keyboard, playing these tone colors by scaling sample instruments. At the very bottom in the middle, Family Computer Disk System, Family Computer, Famicom is a trademark or share of Nintendo. Mystery of Murasama's Castle, Original Soundtrack, 1, Orchestra Version, 2, Mystery of Murasama's Castle Original Version, Mystery of Murasama's Castle, Story, this is the legend just around the Edo period, of Japan, four commanders and chief forces, the Tokugawa Shogun class governed. Many a mystery surrounded the Murasama castle within the castle, a large statue, Murasama, had been enshrined. There exists one night, with the reverberating thunderstorm, a sparkling golden object fell from the sky, soaring to the castle territory, it fell in Murasama castle. Thereupon, mysterious life form dwelling in the large statue, Murasama, enshrined within the castle, a bizarre scream resounded nearby. This rumor spread wide in a flash, on the other hand, the mysterious life form, with the exception of Murasama Castle's four castle lords of each castle whom dominate the mysterious power, were each handed four colored mysterious balls. The lord of each castle with the ball in hand, began manipulating Ningun forces by the power of the ball. The Bakufu felt the rumored situation of the castle lord rebellion, Murasama, was important. In order to test the authenticity of the rumors regarding the assault as ever in this castle town, the young fencing swordsman instructor, Takamaru, had been sent on a secret mission to this castle town. However, the location of that secret life force, Murasama, becomes known. Takamaru departed to the Edo period, Japan, the demon's influence on the shinobi were the cause. A shinobi is basically a Japanese assassin, but the real meaning is stealth, so it's based on grammar. The lord of the castle's Ningun and sorcerers came to attack. Ningun is a combination of stealth, or endurance, an army or force, it's based on two Japanese kanji and would perhaps better translate to stealth force. The journey to Murasama Castle is Ayasama Castle, Akasama Castle, Ryokusama Castle and the 4th Mamasama Castle, those castles and the castle are connected along the main road during your journey to it. All four castles in order are blue, red, green and perhaps pink or light purple, but Momo means peach, so the color is based on the color of a peach. Takamaru had seen to victory with a life and death struggle with Murasama. And what is the mysterious life form's true form? If you acquire the four mysterious balls by defeating the four lords of each castle, Murasama awaits in Murasama Castle. Until then, the enemy must be defeated while advancing the castle's eerie interiors. Takamaru's long journey finally starts. Takamaru's mission is to expose the true form of the mysterious life being. Though Takamaru heads for Castle Murasama, along the way, you must be able to fight with a lot of ninjutsu and sorcery, you cannot move on in advance without it. Again, there are lots of hidden treasure along the journey. Sure enough for you, just how many will you track down? Use weapons skillfully and properly to fight to your advantage. 
Takamaru's weapons are the katana and projectiles. By taking the ninja arts of treasure on you, you can use powerful weapons like a farlang, pinwheel blade and anazuma, among other things. The pinwheel blade is basically a shuriken but pinwheel shaped, its base idea is a blade, but its kanji comes from sword. The types of weapons, listed at the top right in blue lettering, are katana, kazuka, pinwheel blade and flame. The katana is a Japanese sword, even its kanji resembles a sword. The kazuka is a knife attached to the sheath of a sword, but it's not actually kazuka necessarily, it comes from a combination of little and handle, which describes its roots. The flame is self-explanatory, you can fire flame, sort of like in Mario Brothers, but in a different way. How to use the controller. Use is only controller one. Using the cross button pad to move Takamaru, defeat nearby enemies with the katana by using the A button. B button uses an Azuma and the technique of transparency. On the right where the red and beige looking controller, known as the Famicom controller, we have changed Takamaru's direction, pause, uses an Azuma and technique of transparency, swing sword and finally throw projectiles. Summary of enemy characters obstructing Takamaru's path. There are all kinds of enemy characters that will obstruct Takamaru's path of which each respective location they appear in. Try studying their movement and attack patterns. There are 11 types of enemies you can use your weapons to fight against with. Blue Ninja. Just wanders and attacks, comes from the bushes attacking with cross shuriken. White Ninja. Appears along your path, is a low rank ninja with a short yet fast walk, even stronger compared to other colored ninja. If hit, Takamaru's health completely decreases. Again, if you also get hit by the Throne Cross Shuriken, Takamaru's health completely decreases. Black Ninja Targets Takamaru, throws Cross Shuriken. This Cross Shuriken, though Takamaru's katana can swing it downward, when hit by it, Takamaru's health decreases completely. When appearing, projectiles seem to defeat it from a distance. Red Ninja Throws flame aiming at Takamaru. Though Takamaru's weapons cannot evade this flame, if it soars, you can just evade it by escaping yourself. Sparkling Ninja, by flashing white and black, goes to place a time bomb surrounding Takamaru. Though by cutting this ninja with the katana it explodes, use projectiles to defeat it. Health decreases when the explosion surrounds you. Musasabi. Musasabi is basically the stereotypical ninja on a kite. A dangerous ninja that comes to assault Takamaru abruptly. When hurling against Takamaru, health decreases. Though where it appears is not known, avoid being careless. Tsuchigumo, basically a land spider, appears from the ground abruptly. Land spider, known as Tsuchigumo in Japan, is a mythological being in ancient Japan that comes from a land spider or tarantula, and its history goes beyond that, it does not show allegiance to the emperor of Japan. You can find out more on Wikipedia by searching Tsuchigumo. Appears abruptly from within the ground. Weapon is three cross shuikens in succession, and when hit, Takamaru loses health completely. Just below land spider are the following appears from within the ground, throws three cross shuriken, disappears within the ground. Bandit, appears by the rocky mountains. Though not friends of enemies, somehow attacks with an axe. When hit, Takamaru's health decreases completely. Ninja Commander 1, appears when Takamaru is close to the entrance and exit. When close to the entrance and exit, attacks with lightning ball. When hit by it, Takamaru takes damage, health completely decreases. Ninja Commander 2, stands in the way of Takamaru's path, attacks with flame. When hit, and strength completely decreases. Tengu, a long, red-nosed goblin, appears within the forest above the tree. Health decreases when hit by the whirlwind attack. As for within the four castles, there are many enemies and a lord of castle to fight. In order to reach Mirasama's castle, Takamaru must defeat the four lords of the castle of the four castles that hold the mysterious balls. Those four castle names are Ayasama Castle, Akasama Castle, Ryokusama Castle and Mamasama Castle. In English, they are Blue Rain Castle, Red Rain Castle, Green Rain Castle and Peach Rain Castle, which I think it may be a fruit reference to pink or perhaps purple, much like the colors before it. Within each respective castle is the Lord of a Castle, manipulating all kinds of various enemies to shoot at Takamaru. Therefore, several of these enemy characters will introduce themselves. Samurai, master of using the katana, waits in a room to ambush Takamaru. Although generally what is used can kill, when the katana of the samurai is horizontal, projectiles do not apply. Approaching near, aim when the katana is raised overhead. Again, the samurai is always, as on screen above, as tall as Takamaru were standing. Though the opponent does not have projectiles, moving closer step by step, stepping into it all at once, is a surefire way to win. Gatekeeper 1, within each castle, Ayasama Castle, Akasama Castle, Ryokusama Castle and Mamasama Castle, within the space of levels encamped, looking out for this room. 
without defeating all enemies in the room. The level cannot be descended. Attacks with the lasso technique. Lord of Ayasama Castle is Lord of Ayasama Castle. Throws a series of four balls. As soon as having entered the room, it appears damage won't be taken, be careful. When defeated, the mysterious blue sphere will disappear where it rests. Lord of Akasama Castle dominates the second Akasama Castle. Though attacks by throwing balls, this ball changes to white ninjas when it hits the floor and walls with an explosion. Furthermore charges aimed at Takamaru. This lord manipulates ninjutsu by itself, abruptly disappears in a poof, appears again strong. As for projectiles, can make use of strong things as much as possible. Lord of Ryokusama Castle, third lord of castle that can use the copy technique. Throwing balls, Takamaru can face it and attack consistently. Lord of Mamasama Castle, female lord of castle with the technique to manipulate phantom flowers. The phantom flower is a dreadful technique which splits and scatters when hit by something. Whichever first scattered flower hits Takamaru, be cautious as health is completely decreased. Within Murasama's castle is an eerie world of skulls. Defeat the four lords of castle, and if you obtain the four balls, you can enter inside Murasama's castle. The walls of Murasama's eerie castle are skulls. Until now, tougher enemies await you. Devil appears from hiding. Manipulates Jack O' Lantern, throws by aiming two at Takamaru, disappears anywhere. Ninja Commander 3, a fleeing warrior dwelling in Murasama Castle, appears when closer to the entrance and exit. Ninja Commander 4, obstructs Takamaru's path, chases by throwing flame. Gatekeeper 2, is just before Murasama's room, throws light balls. Murasama, manipulates the technique of Devil's Mask, throws a ball with the face of a demon. When hit, health decreases. Again, health decreases completely when hit by the floating in mid-air ball. How to kill Murasame? To kill Murasame, projectiles are effective. To track down Murasame's weak spot, aim for that directly. There is just one weak spot. Ninja Art's technique of transparency with B button. When taking the scroll appearing from the Takuni, you have three times to use the ninja arts of becoming invisible and invincible. Takamaru can hold this one scroll at the start of the game, ninja arts batch of three cannot hold more than one projectile. With the A button, B button, you cannot carry more than two at once. That and, the next weapon you pick ends it, and for example, the effects of a weak weapon you come about, ends by changing to it. Yurashima's Casket. Power up further picking it up. Yurashima's Casket, whether stepping on it or treasure appearing by cutting with the katana, it's a power up character for Takamaru. For one thing, track down many. Ninja Arts Technique of Quick Steps. Each time you pick up the red strawed sandals and Takamaru speeds up by two levels. Typically, miss once and it goes back to normal. Ninja Arts Technique of Water Walking Shoes When picking up the blue strawed sandals, you can walk on water with the same speed you walk on land. Its effects go away when missing one time. The boss of enemies, mysterious life forms, weak spot, let's learn by this code quiz. The last mysterious life form comes, cannot be defeated without attacking the weak spot. As for this weak spot, the secrecy handed to Takamaru to the next code if the solution is understood. When unable to solve, you must try to attack with all your might. The hint refers to Morse code, based on our research, and we had to look this up online and we found it actually means, within the mouth, as the answer. Our riddle is based on guesswork and may not be accurate, but we relied on an obscure answer for the riddle and we found it. The website we researched the answer for, even a Japanese native did not understand it. Within, the, mouth, that is the weak spot, it's obvious because its mouth is wide open. Turns out Japan has their own Morse code, which surprised us, a first for us. Thank you for watching and listening to this manual of mystery of Murasama's castle, it was fun to work on. Please consider supporting Miyaku Gaming if you can, it helps us produce translations faster with absolutely no censorship and we focus on accuracy.